Hello, Haler and Caretaker, and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, it looks like it's going to be cloudy, but a very intense day spiritually today for the Virgos, the Virgins, the Healers, the Caretakers of the Zodiac. The Moon is still in Leo. Your emotional focus is still on subconscious. It's still on weeds in your soul garden. But today we are blessed with it conjuncting Venus. Venus, the focusing agent of love and creativity. Right now, Venus in Leo been helping Virgos develop a new inner faith as it's crossed through your 12th house. This is in preparation for the next couple of days events, by the way. More on that in a second. So today, really, allow yourself to love the faith you have in the universe. Allow yourself to indulge the faith you already have and allow yourself to ask for creatively with loving uh, questions or loving uh, desire what type of faith you wish to have. For instance, you may say, I want to have faith when I walk through the dark. I don't want to be afraid of things in the dark. I want to have faith when I'm shaking someone's hand that they're not looking at my teeth. Seriously, with Virgos especially, you can get to that kind of nuance. Now, I do believe that by putting a little investment in new faith in yourself today, it will pay off in one month. That's because as of now, Venus is opposing Jupiter, Neptune, and Chiron, which are retrograde in Aquarius, and they go direct next month. Jupiter particularly goes direct. That tells me that by creating faith today, you'll find your lifestyle expanding and fortune coming into your life in Rocktober. Now, zip it on the sun. Happy birthday, Virgo. We're at the apex now. The sun today is dead conjuncting Saturn. That means all Virgos are out of time. It is time to come up with what you see as Virgo 2.0. Now, as of today, Neptune is ruling the day, which means we are all more intuitive than usual. Excellent day to log into your higher self and really get the clarity of what that Virgo 2.0 looks like, what that ego looks like, what that ego acts like, where that ego will defend for you, what that ego will not surrender to anymore. So if someone insults you, you won't surrender. If someone overpowers you, maybe you won't surrender. Remember, ego is a good thing. It's here to represent us formally. And today you want to get clarity on this because tomorrow we begin a two-day light cast day period of four planet stellium. In my astrological belief, this will be the point where the universe just knocks it out of the ballpark. So today is your last day to aim on exactly what you want for ego. The universe is taking over. Now, speaking of aiming, we have a new episode of Skip Jennings, our urban mystic, live today on the mothership. He's going to be answering viewer questions that you have emailed into him and getting very deep in this final hour for Chapter 3 of Sun and Virgo in the next couple of days. So don't miss Skip. He's live on the mothership today at soulgarden.tv. All right, healers, that's all I have for the day. I'll see you folks tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So